Hello everyone and welcome back to Sneaker Huddle Weekly. In today's video, we'll be breaking down the best sneaker releases Monday through Saturday. So if you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe. And without further ado, guys, let's get straight into Sneaker Huddle Weekly. Kicking it off on Tuesday will be the women's Air Jordan 1 Low Marina Blue. These will drop over in Europe after they did drop in the United States last week. Retail has been set at 100 bucks. And if you missed last week's segment, we do have a brand new Twitter account for European viewers that will cover all sneaker European releases. I'll leave the top link to it in the description below. Be sure to follow if you're in Europe. Also on Tuesday, April the 12th, will be a Cold Walls collaboration with Converse on a brand new sneaker silhouette. Retail has been set at 160 bucks. Now comment your thoughts on a Cold Walls Converse collaboration. I really love this unique design and twist that they do have on this silhouette. It's a very, very good looking sneaker and it looks like it may be even very comfortable. Uh, so if they continue to make this in other colorways and probably my preference would be an all white colorway, I'll definitely cop this one to try it out, especially if people say that it's a very comfortable sneaker because I kind of like the way these look. And finally making its way to the United States after a delay from last month was the Nike SB Dunk Low Polaroid. Retail has been set at 120 bucks. These did drop in Europe last week. And if you did miss our last week's segment of Sneaker Huddle Weekly, we did talk about the importance of finding the nearest skate shops to you and entering those raffles. But now it's too late if you haven't done so already. But for future reference, just be sure to go to nikesb.com, filter from your location and find the closest Nike skate shops to you. Follow them on Instagram to enter their raffles. But if you did miss out, these will drop on Nike sneakers in the United States. Retail is 120. And in terms of the resale prediction and the best time to buy these sneakers, I probably would be a little patient with these. I would expect these to get all the way down to around 170 bucks. So slightly above retail value. So if you do strike out on this pair, would be patient uh, because you should be able to find these for a pretty decent price. Also dropping on Tuesday on Nike US will be the women's Air Jordan 1 Mid in a cream and blue colorway that's referred to as the Sail in Midnight Navy. Retail has been set at 135. And moving over to Wednesday, April 13th, the grade school Air Jordan 1 Mid green and gray will drop for a retail point of 105 on Nike US. And while we're talking on Nike US, on the next day, on April the 14th, this upcoming Thursday, the Air Max 95 in the Summit White and Wolf Gray colorway will drop on Sneakers US for 175 bucks. And the pair on Thursday the 14th that will drop worldwide that everyone will be more excited for will be the Nike Air Trainer 1 Utility in the Light Smoke Gray and Honeydew colorway. Retail has been set at 140 and these will drop worldwide. Moving over to Friday, April 15th, the Nike Air Force 1 Low and the L Brown and Sand Drift colorway will drop Sneakers US for 100 bucks. Also dropping alongside the pair on Nike sneakers, finish line, JD Sports, and various Jordan retailers will be the women's Air Jordan 1 Low, Elevate Low in the University Blue colorway. And I have to say for this Elevate Jordan 1 Low, I'm very surprised that they have sat on shelves and dropped below retail value uh, because the bread colorway, as you saw, maybe, maybe not, they, you can pick those up for around 100 bucks on StockX, so it proved to that if you were patient on the sneaker, you could have possibly picked it up at the outlets or either below retail value. So the fact that the Brett colorway did that would expect this UNC colorway to do the same, but I really don't hate these. Um, I actually bought the Brett colorway for my girlfriend and tried to surprise her with them, and she didn't really like them too much in a nice way, uh, so we did return them. But I really like these Air Jordan 1 Low Elevates, but I guess the females don't. Also dropping on Friday, the grade school Air Jordan 1 Low Light Curry will drop in grade school sizes. Retail is 95 bucks and these will drop on Nike US. And the most anticipated sneaker for the entire week, no matter who you are, you will agree with this. And that is Union's collaboration on the Air Jordan 2. The sneakers will drop alongside a Jordan apparel pieces where we'll see t-shirts, we'll see sweatshirts, long sleeve shirts, sweatpants, and jackets. But the collection is the Union Los Angeles Air Jordan Future Is Now collection. 
The two Air Jordan 2 colorways that we will see release is first up the gray fog and also the Rattan colorway. Retail for both pairs have been set at a retail point of $225. Now these will drop this upcoming Friday on unionlosangeles.com and as always, we will see a new domain release for this pair of sneakers. And we have more details coming very, very soon on what exactly to expect. If you've been in the sneaker game for a while, you already know what's gonna happen, but feel free to tune into that video to refresh the skills or kind of refresh your mind to what exactly to expect. Now it's very important to follow Sneaker Huddle on Twitter and enable post notifications because as soon as the new domain goes up, we'll tweet it out for you guys for free. So if you are interested in copying the Air Jordan 2 Union collaboration, would recommend to hit the link in the description and follow Sneaker Huddle on Twitter. Now in terms of the estimated resale prediction for the Union Los Angeles Air Jordan 2's resale is currently $500 and up, but would recommend to be patient for this drop because I do think that resale prices will drop to $400 if you do strike out on the pair for retail. So I think patience will reward you for being a little patient for this release and wait for prices to get lower uh, to try to pick it up for the best prices possible. Now moving over to Saturday, April 16th, the grade school Nike Dunk High Cargo Khaki will drop for a retail point of 90 bucks. And the last sneaker summing it up for this week and the segment of Sneaker Huddle Weekly, we thank you for tuning in to another episode. And this one is one that I really, really love the colors that they used on this Air Jordan 7 Retro, but the 7 just isn't one of my favorite Air Jordans. If they could have put this colorway on a three, a four, a one, uh, even the two, maybe the five, it would have been an absolute must cop, even a few others of the Jordan Retro silhouettes. But this one is the Sapphire colorway. These will drop in the United States only. They've already released over in Europe, but retail has been set at 210 US dollars. But I do think that patience will reward you on this release. I think that you probably can't beat it for retail value. Uh, if you do pick this up on drop day, that's probably the lowest that you're going to get because I would expect it to get maybe to $180 to $200 on StockX and Go eBay reselling platforms, but you're going to end up paying taxes, shipping, and fees. So probably the best price that you will get for this pair of sneakers will be for picking it up on retail on release day. And these will be widely available on Nike sneakers and Jordan retailers. Now, this is the moment where you comment down below what is your favorite sneaker that's gonna be dropping this week. And you already know what it is gonna be for me. And that's Union LA's collaboration on the Air Jordan 2. And of the two colorways, I really like both of them. I don't think I kind of prefer one over the other. Both are super solid and wouldn't mind having either or in the collection, but would love to hear your sneaker of the week down below in the comments and be sure to follow us on Twitter if you're interested in copying those Air Jordan 2s and be sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Enable post notifications here also on Twitter. God bless each and every one of you. Best of luck on the week and have a great one.